I'm Bobby Lee from AussieTheatre.com. Now we are at the Brisbane Powerhouse at New Farm, which has been a hub of activity over the last week. And with me, we have a comedian. He's also a magician and he's got a special act in that he makes his clothes disappear. See what I mean? Magic. Now, this is Christopher Wayne. He is half of the Naked Magicians with Mike Tyler. Hey. Hi. Yes, Naked. I'm a bit disappointed that it's just one of us. I feel like you should have come to the party, but that's okay. Uh, now, does this have a name? I'm talking about the bunny. <laughs> yeah, this is Snuggles. You want to give him a pat? Um, We're still talking about sorry. the bunny. Okay, yeah, sorry. That's Snuggles, and uh, he's a big part of the show. Okay, now I do have to ask you, most important question, wardrobe malfunctions. It has happened once. In fact, during a, a photo shoot, uh, when we did the original photo shoot for the poster, there was one where uh, my non-snuggles was hanging out the bottom of the top hat, just the tiniest bit, and we didn't realise. And we actually sent it out in our first press release to some of the press down in a state that I will not mention, but we got an email saying, hey, uh, what's up with the, the photo? And then we had a look at it, and there was just this little tiny bit of mini Chris sticking out the bottom of the hat. It's a good problem to have at the end of the day, but it's just not something you want to send to the press. So those shows obviously sold out. Yeah. <laughs> it turns out sex sells. Who knew? Yeah. Now, how did you come up with the concept of the show? Like, did you audition for Puppetry or the Penis and got rejected? <laughs> no, definitely uh, not. Um, kudos to those guys for doing what they do, but it's not my thing. Um, the show was created by Simon Painter, who created The Illusionist, uh, the biggest magic show in history. He had the idea for a really cool poster, and that poster was a man standing with a top hat covering his, uh, his penis. And um, he, so he had the idea for the poster and the name, and he asked me, I was working as a, as a manager and consultant for The Illusionist, he asked me to write a show based on that poster. Um, I'd done some comedy writing myself for the B105 Breakfast Show for four years, so I went and put together what I thought would be a really cool idea for a show, which was a, a magic show that was very cheeky and very naughty, very sexy, very funny, very magical. So uh, it was a combination of, uh, of Simon's brain and then me and Mike getting together and coming up with some dirty magic. Yeah. Dirty magic. I've never heard that before. Sorry, I shouldn't say dirty magic because it's, uh, for all things it is, it is, it is classy. It's, it's, <laughs> it's the, the naughtiest, cheekiest, sexiest and funniest magic show. We don't, we don't go below the belt, but we, we grab onto the belt and aren't afraid to, to yank it off. Okay. Now, this is Christopher Wayne. Uh, you're just half. Mike Tyler. That's exactly right. Mike Tyler is the other now half of the show. Now, you've both got a, your own special, unique, magical skills. What's your particular skill and what's Mike's? Um, I, we complement each other really well. Mike's a really good straight, a straight guy in the show, but he's got some, um, some fantastic uh, little bits. And, and I'm more of a funny guy. Mike's got the six-pack, and I've got the quick, funny one-liners because I'm not in as good shape as him. Mm, how about that? Mike is an amazing entertainer. He does amazing close-up magic and stage, and one of his specialities is hypnotism, and um, made a large part of his career prior to this doing um, sold-out hypnotism shows around the world. But that's not something we incorporate into this show. Okay. Um, and you said you'd had time writing for B105. Mm. So those guys on the radio, just, they're actually not funny? It's you? <laughs> I will tell you that they are the funniest people I've ever met. So um, they just, it was one of those things where two heads are better than one. Oh, that, that could be one of the little things for our poster, but anyway. Can you show me something quick? We're going to do a quickie. Oh, we're going to do a quickie? Why not? Oh, geez, we, we haven't even had a drink, <laughs> but sure, why not? Um, if I'm going to do a trick, I'm going to need both my hands. But All right. It's very important that this stays there. So with your, uh, your left hand, I'm going to get you to just plant it right on the front and hold that top hat into place. And uh, Things we you... do for art. Oh, the things we do. Thank you for suffering for your art. Maybe just a little bit lower. <laughs> there we go. That's it. Yeah. Okay. Um, so this is a deck of cards, 52 different cards the whole way through, and it's very important. You can see that they're all different. And I'm just going to get you right now to name one random card, any card at all. Okay, nine of diamonds. Nine of diamonds. Okay, watch this, just with my left hand here. I'm going to cut the deck. Um, this is the only cut thing in the show. And um, get one card to jump out and catch it, and it should be the nine of diamonds. God. Good magicians nine of diamonds. don't need sleeves. Great magicians don't need don't pants. Need clothes. That's exactly how it works. I'm Bobby Lee. This is AussieTheatre.com. And I'm happy.